Okay, so let's say, for example, that you have a drawing where multiple people are working on it, and you know that the room size or the building size, whatever the object may be, in this case it's going to be a room, needs to be 25 feet by 20 feet. All right, we, we know that's an unknown dimension, that's what we need to be at. But for whatever reason, we had to receive the drawing from, from another designer, and their scale was off, and something, something went a little wonky. And the scale was off and we know that we can scale it back down. So the one, the, the room on the left uh, with the white uh, lines is going to be our, our target size. And the one on the right uh, references you know, the incorrectly scaled one. So since we have a frame of reference here, which is similar on both of them, being the doorway, we can use that as our reference point and reference dimension to scale everything down. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go into my the room that I know is correct, and I'm just going to zoom in. I'm hit DI for dimension, and I'm going to scale the inside of the door, and it is three feet wide. Okay, so now that we know that, I want to scale the blue room down so that the doorway, which in this case is a little over five feet, equals three feet, and when I do that, everything else should follow suit, and if we all do everything right, this should be a 25 by 20 row. So the first thing I want to do is type in scale. Then I'm going to select all the objects. Then hit enter. Now as to, to specify a base point, you can pick any point you like, but I'm going to keep on using the same base point. And I'm going to use the uh, the inside of the doorway. And now I can drag and you know drag everything around. But again, even if we do that, we can only get to, to within the limits of our, our dragon capabilities and we have a better way of doing this. Now, if we look on the bottom of our screen, it says scale, specify, scale, factor, or copy a reference. So in this case, you either click on the reference or type R for reference because we have a reference length and that refer reference length is our doorway. So I'm gonna hit R, enter. And now it's asking me to specify a reference length. Now our reference length is gonna be inside of our doorway. So I'm gonna left click on the inside of our door jam and left click again, select the end point. And I now have a reference point and we know that because we have that orange dotted line. And once again, we can still do the drag feature, but we're not gonna worry about that because we know that our reference length needs to be 36 inches. So I'm just gonna type in 36 inches and hit enter. As you see, everything's scaled down to 25 by 20. And just to verify, the inside of our doorway is in fact three feet wide.